on air what's up YouTube today I want to show you an app for your iPhone and this app is special for uh, newsmakers you know bloggers people that you know want to um, record a situation and this is for iPhone I'm sure there's also something out there for Android but this is strictly for iPhone users so iPhone users um, I'm gonna try to show you this program and to do that I will fire up iTools and iTools will let me connect to my device so I'm gonna show you an app people that bloggers can use and you know sometimes you come at a place and you don't want to record the whole thing but you just want to record uh, the sound of the environment where you are at uh, for instance you are rehearsing with some uh, musicians you know and you record the rehearsal and after that you make a picture of everybody who was in the rehearsal with the same device and then you know uh, you put the picture and the music together and you have an mp4 file that will be saved to your pictures you know that is a big thing because most of these apps memo apps you know will save uh, to some place that you cannot get to you must with iTunes or with iTools you know uh, do abacadabra to get to these files you know that while these are your files created by you you know Apple did not think of that to make a little folder you know when connecting the iPhone to a computer you know that the automatic hard uh, hard drive device will you know power up and show the hard drive of the iPhone just as it does for the videos and for the pictures but then again memo recordings are not in there and to get to your memo recordings you must have a computer with iTunes and lots of nonsense man so yo I hope that in the coming versions of you know iOS Apple will at least you know uh, think of the mercy of the people you know who uh, of have mercy on the people who create their own memo things you know I mean no copyright of, of whatsoever on that that is our copyright you know we we created that that how you call it um, that recording so you know why keep it away from us why do we need iTunes to get to to these recordings so that was for Apple that was not for you guys so let's go to the app now peeps the app is called voice record and here you can see it it's a very very beautiful app here you can see some recordings that I made already so what what we're gonna do we're gonna make uh, we're gonna make a photo video with sound okay so here you see the record, you see the, uh, the the stop and the play button. You also here on top see configure and you can go to settings. Here you can turn on instant recording. You know that means if you hit recording it will be it will record immediately. You know you don't have to hit the record again. Um, here you can see these settings. I would not touch this and I would change to MP4. Uh, it's normally on M4A. But I would rather go for MP4 because that's easier to edit. You know, if you want to make a little YouTube video of something that you know, for instance, we're gonna do, we're gonna create a photo video right now. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna hit record. You see that? And here you can also change the settings, sample rate. Here you can put the sample rate to to 44.100 high quality stereo you can put it to 160 up there and the this you can put on 16 24 bits 32 amazing you see that I would just put it on 16 and you could make it stereo and I'm not sure if you can record stereo with this thing and encode quality maximum I don't know what that means but I think the best quality okay so now we're gonna make a recording I will just hit the record testing one two okay we're recording now with uh, this beautiful app uh, the voice recorder and I'm making a review for YouTube and you can see the level meter there is also like a calibration in here and you can calibrate 
the environment uh, sounds and it will automatically detect the right um, volume for the microphone although I'm not sure how uh, it does that but I made some recordings already and I just put it to the very highest uh, possible uh, recording quality which I did not did before and uh, I'm sure that this recording will sound even better than you know the ones that I made and it's such a pity because if I knew that and I just discovered it while making this review uh, if I knew that before then I would surely set these settings to a uh, high quality stereo 44 you know etc so at least the listener uh, would have a better uh, higher and uh, better sound although I must say that the sound quality is not bad at all the way it was set to lo low quality and the files are not big they are really small anyway this was a little short test and uh, I want to thank you for listening to this and bye bye okay we hit stop now and now we get into another menu and here in this menu you will see certain stuff here you can scroll down you see that you can do several things convert to mp3 make a copy append to another record you know um, Wi-Fi download, uh, post to Facebook, uh, website upload, FTP, blah -de blah but none of that we will choose. We will go and make a picture first. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make a selfie. Let's make a selfie. Turn the cam. So I just made a selfie. Maybe I should make it like this. Okay, I just made the selfie and then we go back to the program. This is really amazing for ook for journalisten. Yo, this is echt gek for jullie. Uh, guys that make the news, you know, that has to, but I'm sure you guys already have great apps doing this. Okay, so what we will do now, let's see if this is the recording. This sounds amazing. I already hear it, the quality. Uh, we, oh yeah, did you see what I did? I hit it on top here. You see where you see file size on top here? I will put my finger on it now. Hope you can see it. Yeah, it's selected. And then we hit that one. You see that? And then we go to albums. We go to camera roll. And we take the picture that we just uh, downloaded or that we just created and you know we can put it a bit like this you know the headphone was making my face a little stupid so let me look for another picture yeah this one is nice that's me man that's me yo so then we hit close and now you will see that the picture is on top there and then we say save to photo album and then we just save it yo and then here we can uh, choose another thumbnail but we already choose one we love this one and we just hit continue and now your voice re uh, your voice recording is saved to um to to your photo album i would never ever use uh, the the original you know voice memo recorder of iphone anymore now now that we have this program you know and i'm gonna show it to you we go to my photos and up here the last video here one minute 25 there it is we just created this We created a, yeah, not really a photo story, but a photo video, a still video with sound, however you want to call it, but just think of the possibilities. I see many possibilities in this, you know, um, 
if you want to interview somebody but you don't want to film the person you know but you a picture will just do fine for a news item or for something real fast or maybe um yeah you um you make a picture of some band playing live somewhere you know and you don't want to film the whole thing because maybe it's you know um maybe the sun stands straight in your face or maybe it's not allowed to film or whatever you know you make a picture pups you put the thing in your pocket with the external microphone you record the sound you put them two together you know and you have a photo video for own usage of you know or sharing with your friends so that's it yo i hope you like this program i think it's an amazing program to have a must for every video maker every blogger to have on their uh on their little uh iphone because this is for iphone this is for ios 7 i think i'm not sure if it works on 613 but you should test that out anyway um yeah how can you find this program it's called voice record let me see if I can find a site here somewhere for you guys. Um, voice record. I'm not sure if it's if this was. Yeah, look here it is. You see, Voice Record Pro. That's the name. It's from Diana Networks. Yo, hey, I I think it's a pity that there are no um no likes no nothing there you guys never left them a little thumbs up you know for this beautiful app that while it's free you know so uh, i think that's a shame because this i think is the best recording program ever made for iphone so i want you all to massively support these guys you know and um leave your thumbs up rate the program up there i rated 10 stars so that's my story and um yeah i want to thank the guys of uh voice record pro for this beautiful uh this beautiful app um and you know i will keep promoting it and keep using it and uh, big up to all the developers out there and big up to all the people that will start using this program because i think it's a kind of new program i never saw it before it looks amazing it looks very uh analog uh it's like you know uh, going back in time you know having this real few uh, meters you know it's really amazing so check it out and uh, tell me what you think of the app if you like this video this information if it helped you to do your work even better uh, don't forget to like this video for me and of course uh, subscribe to my channel and peace out bye